Welcome to the quiz from the Video Teach project. This one is about basic information and types of protection of the created content. Have you remembered the main points of the video course? Test yourself in this short quiz. Question number one. Which of the following is not one of the various protection and sharing methods that can be used to protect the content created on social media and other open platforms? Option A, terms of service. Option B, writing author's name on file names. Option C, privacy settings. Now you have about 15 seconds to think about your answer. The correct answer is option B. Naming the files will do nothing to protect the artifact. However, detailed settings such as copyrights, privacy settings, and terms of use are very important in protecting the work. Question number two. Which of the following is a kind of Creative Commons licenses? Option A, CCBY. Option B, CDBY. Option C, CXBY. Now you have about 15 seconds to think about your answer. The correct answer is option A. By combining these components, creators can choose from six main Creative Commons licenses and all licenses starts with CC. Question number three. What do the terms and conditions agreements cover? Option A. It covers only financial responsibilities. Option B. It covers usage details such as the user manual of internet tools. Option C. These agreements contain clauses regarding content ownership, usage rights, and penalties for copyright infringement. Now you have about 15 seconds to think about your answer. The correct answer is C. These agreements usually focus on content ownership, usage rights, and penalties for copyright infringement. Question number four. Which of the following are not essential components of CC licenses? Option A, attribution BI. Option B, non-commercial NC. Option C, no share NS. Now you have about 15 seconds to think about your answer. The correct answer is C, no share. These license types are BY, SA, NC, and ND. Question number five. What is the watermarking? Option A, writing on water. Option B, it is a visible or invisible mark added to preserve the authenticity of images. Option C, adding water drops to images. Now you have about 15 seconds to think about your answer. The correct answer is option B. A watermark is used to indicate ownership of an image or video to prevent unauthorized use. Congratulations! This is the end of the quiz about basic information and types of protection of the created content. We hope you enjoyed it, and if you like it, you can try another one from the Video Teach project. Thank you very much for going through the quiz with us. You can continue following us on YouTube or our other channels, such as Facebook or the official website of the project at videoteach.u. All the content of the Video Teach project has been produced through the international collaboration of nine expert partners, 
and is funded by the European Union.